begin. We are recording. Hi, my name is Richard Finn. I would like to show you how to floss your tibial nerve. You might do this if you've got tightness in the back of your calf. And I'm sure you've seen the regular runners stretch that people like to do. That's nice, but I find if you put the ball of your foot up against the wall, keep the legs straight, and lean your body weight forward like this, that you get a nice stretch on that. So that's a way to stretch it. If you want to get the soleus muscle underneath, you can simply bend the knee and do the same thing. Now, that, but to pass stretching and go on to flossing the nerve, it's important to realize that the position of the head is all important. When somebody gets arrested, they always throw the head back. The reason they throw the head back is it gets the pressure off the nerves. That makes the pain less. We're going to use that in order to floss the nerve. So I'm going to put the ball of my foot up, and I'm going to lean my body weight forward. That's the stretch. Now what I want to do is practice tipping my head backwards and do a slight pulsing. And again, this goes on for about 10 repetitions to help loosen this whole area up. Now, things that you can do to modify that is put the foot one way, inside or outside. That changes where you feel it down in the calf. It also changes the angle of pull on the nerves all the way up into the buttock. So try this out, and if it works for you, that is fantastic. I get a lot of good reports on that. Thank you so much for letting me show you how to floss on your tibial nerve.